the Sam Sellers in three, two, one. Sam, you've been a guy that's been around this program a little while. Talk about this year's team. It, it seemed like this was a, a team that just took a little while to mature, but well, toward the end of the season, it's like you guys came together. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, we started out with a devastating loss, you know, to Bowling, or we know Bowling Green, and then a loss to UAB by that uh, Hail Mary, and it was kind of we're kind of iffy about getting everything started back up because you know, we're used to winning, you know, and uh, when uh, we lost to uh, Monroe, it kind of hurt everybody, but we got some younger guys, you know, that are just now starting to play and, and mature a little bit, so it's been it's been real positive watching them grow up a little bit, but we're, we're really excited about it, the whole situation. Talking to you seniors throughout the year, that seemed to be kind of the deal. You couldn't really figure out why this team wasn't coming together, but uh, maybe it was the youth and just took a little while to mature. Yeah, um, I, I think, you know, that had a lot to do with it, but, you know, when I mean, you got older guys playing the ball game too, we just had several mistakes and just errors on our part. You know, the coaching was there. I mean, it's it's, it's obviously the players, but I, I think that uh, this game is gonna is gonna uh, show show our real true spirit as Troy Trojans. Now you're one of the few guys that were affiliated with this program. I don't think you played in the game, but you were around when they last won a bowl game, won the only bowl game. Talk about the disappointment the last couple of times and an opportunity here. What's been the focus? I, I mean, it seems like it's, it's more than just getting here. You guys want to get a win. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, we um, that one one big win against Rice, uh, I guess it was in 06 it was, was it was great for the program, great for everybody. You know, it really helped us do a lot of good recruiting, and it just looks good on a team. And then to go uh, to play another one year right here and play uh, Southern Miss and lose by a field goal after winning, you know, most of the game. And then also at the GMAC, it was, it was pretty devastating. But to be a senior in the last game, you know, we're, we're really looking forward to get a win here, especially against uh, a uh, MAC team. Jonathan Massaquan, three, two, one. Jonathan, what's been the key Jonathan, early in the year, you were one of the guys that were a little bit outspoken about this team. It looked like they were just having trouble kind of coming together, but toward the end of the year, it looks like they figured it out and everything finished up nicely for you to get down here to the boat. Yes, that's correct. Uh, you know, things uh, went our way sort of kind of um, at the beginning. Things were rocky. Uh, we handled adversity throughout the year, um, you know, due to injuries, uh, you know, growing pains, um, such as the team growing and beginning to have chemistry together. So, uh, you know, we all persevered through it. And they brought us here to this point, and this was our main goal, which was uh, winning five conference champions and uh, championships in a row. Um, we're here now, so uh, the guys are excited. I'm excited. We're ready to go play on Saturday. I know on the defensive side of the ball, it was really frustrating. It just seemed like it just couldn't quite put the games together. Was that just a matter of youth and, and taking a little longer for this team to mature? Um, you know, as I said, it goes into growing pains. It goes into guys working every day together, being around each other, building chemistry, um, having that family bond, um, as you may so call it. Um, and we gained that towards the end of the season. Um, we had a spark at the beginning. Then, um, you know, we decreased um, as players started getting hurt. You know, um, a lot of things were brought about. Um, but towards the end, we all got together. We knew what the bigger picture was. Um, we locked and loaded in the last three games. We had an amazing um, come up. Talk about the chance to get down here at the end of the year in New Orleans, the place where this team's, uh, this program's won its only bowl game. Since then, a couple of real disappointing uh, efforts. Talk about the opportunity to come down. I know you guys are focused more on just getting here, but you want to get the win. Oh, definitely. The win is very important. Um, history we're one and two right now in, here in New Orleans and um, as far as bowl games um, you know we've always come through halftime you know late overtimes um, situations so uh, being here in this predicament and uh, me um, me being here and the ambitions I have for myself um, I'm going to rally guys around me um, hopefully that sparks something within someone else um, so uh, I'm excited about it I'm ready to play I'm ready to uh, showcase my talent and, I'm, and the rest of the guys around me are, are also on the same page as well. So, like I said, we're excited. We're ready to win. Uh, we got Coach Larry Blake leading us in the way. One. Daniel, I've talked to some of the other guys about this season and how it unfolded. It looked like during the season a lot of frustration with this team, particularly on the defensive side. It took a little while to come together, but it looks like the last couple of games you guys got it figured out. We just, uh, um, we just really came together as a team. Like most people, most people were doubting us early in the season. Basically, we was doubting ourselves, and we basically just had to pull it, pull it together and stick together as a team and basically just come as one and win a couple games, and then we did, and we put ourselves in a great position. Are you one of the senior guys, particularly on the defensive unit, that's very young? For whatever reason, you guys are having to play a lot of young players. Was it just a matter of these guys maturing and starting to figure the game out? Uh, a little bit of that, and a little bit of distractions and some more stuff, I guess you can add on to that. But... We 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 all is we all is one now, so good things happen. 
you get a chance now to come down to New Orleans. This is a place where Troy's experienced his only bowl win since then. A couple of real disappointing losses, uh, both in overtime, one in double overtime. I know you guys certainly are glad to be here, but you want to win this game. Oh yes, sir. That's, that's number one, number one priority. What we're down here, basically focus. We came a long way from up and down season. Try to win this bowl game and have fun out. Talk about this Ohio U team. What do you know about these guys? Um, I know they're well disciplined. They do everything right. They're some good character guys. Down to earth. I talked to a couple of them out on Bourbon Street or whatnot. Um, it's just good guys, you know. Friendly. I ain't really got too much bad words about them. They're a very good, very nice team. On offense, I mean it.